Hi, in this video I'll be demonstrating how to replace the Dell 40 watt hour lithium battery in a Dell Vostro laptop. For best practices, use an earth strap and connect the other side to an earth point. If you don't have such a thing, make sure to work in a static free environment. If you don't have an earth band, make sure to touch the ground with your bare hand prior to opening the laptop. The first step is to remove the power. Make sure the unit has powered off. Remove any peripherals such as a USB dongle or a memory card. Flip the unit over and there are star screws on the back. These two screws over here do not come out completely. Notice that once I've unscrewed that screw, the screw remains inside but it does lift this back cover. Use this as the starting point to remove the back cover with a pry tool. So I take the pry tool and I just go like this along the side. If you do not have a pry tool, you can use your fingernail. For example, I'm using a nail to pry open the side. I use my fingers along the sides to pry open the back cover. For best practices, use a pry tool. Once all the sides have been loosened, you can now lift off the back cover. To replace the battery, I first need to unplug the old battery. I locate the battery connector and there is a tab here which I can pull towards me. So I grab it with a balanced force and I pull towards me like that and I've now disconnected the battery. To remove the battery I need to remove one, two, three screws. Being very careful I can gently lift the battery out, be careful of this cable over here and I gently slide it out away from me. Right, once you have your brand new battery just make sure that this power cable is seated nicely. Now I just need to insert it under this cable here. So I'm going to align it. Notice this loop is going over that post. So I'm going like this and you can use that post as a guide. And then on this side I'm aligning that with the screw holes over there. And I just make sure that that seats over the post which it has. This is now seated in place. Notice I have not disturbed or damaged this cable over here at all. Return your three screws. Now it's time to plug in the battery. Notice there's a ridge there and a ridge there. Those slide into the gaps over there taking a balanced force in a horizontal motion. So I'm going away from me and I take both my fingers and I pinch this plug back into its housing. It is now fully inserted. You can now replace the cover. Right, replace the back cover, keeping in mind the cutouts for the hinges. Using a balanced force, starting from the middle, I just depress the back cover. So I just press it down along the sides. Now, keeping in mind these screws are protruding out, so I just need to screw them in quickly. While I'm screwing it in, I press it down. Take your palms and just squeeze all around the sides like this. The back cover should have no gaps along the travel. Return all the screws. Make sure all the screws are in place and you can now turn on your laptop. If you turn on the machine and the time and date is incorrect, when you boot up to Windows, just go to the settings and press the Sync Now button to sync your time and date. Thanks for watching and cheers.